That's exactly what it is. It's so much easier than I ever imagined or thought. But it does require the intimacy of dwelling in that place. And sometimes it takes time to get to that place because of all the other stuff, the mindsets and belief systems, the way we feel about ourselves and the fact that you know, we've been conditioned by a whole load of conditioning through culture and through religion, which hinders me just being because it's all doing. That's the problem. My culture and my religious upbringing was all about what I had to do. None of it equipped me to be. It just wore me out doing. But God had a plan. He took me through the doing so I could become who I am. So I, to be, you know, I am that I am. It's, it's the sort of state of being and conscious awareness of just being me. You know, and he, yes, he took me through all the things of learning and then realizing that that was who I always was anyway. You know, but that's me. Someone may not need to do all that. You know, I, I, I'm me and I have a particular purpose in some things of helping other people. So being able to explain something is helpful to some people. You know, but for others, you know, who aren't me, you may never need to know all the stuff I know or all the stuff other people know. All you need to know is what you need to know. And most of that is actually who you are. Not how to do it all. You know, and a lot of what we do is help people to understand how to do it. And then when they get close to God, they'll realize, oh, I'm doing all that anyway, because that's who I am. Yeah. Now, when I had the revelation of multidimensional living, God showed me. You know, he, he spoke to me and he said, I'm taking the blinkers off your eyes because you've only had glimpses of who you are. So I thought, oh, OK. And then he then revealed each multi-dimensional non-linear perspective that i am and i realized wow i never realized i had such a capacity in who i am i never realized that i could be in multiple places doing multiple things synchron synchronously simultaneously i didn't realize but i was doing it without realizing it because if i did realize it i wouldn't have thought i could have done it i would have tried to figure out how i could possibly do it so god was very wise in that he didn't show me while i was doing all these things and actually just being until i was able to be able to take on that on board and it didn't freak me out and i just rejoiced in it it's like wow i'm this is who I am, you know? And yeah, there was a whole lot of stuff that was flowing out of who I am. But I don't have to consciously go and try and do all that every day. If I did, I would be totally burnt out. Completely, if I tried to do everything that I am in a workspace mentality, I would be completely burnt out. Yeah. You know? And God was... He, I got a glimpse along the way until he took the blinkers off and said, now you're ready to see. And I'm like, whoa, this is beyond what I could have imagined or possibly thought. Now I can just say, wow, awesome. You know, and I just carry on being. You know, and I think that's the key for all of us. That is what rest is. We rest from doing so that we can just be and everything just flows out of our being if you enjoy these videos would you please take a moment to like comment and subscribe it really does help thank you very much